Right. Go. Okay. So uh, I'm Gilbert Ren. I'm working with uh, Algae for Oil Group. Okay. <laughs> so. Okay, so um, explain that, explain uh, the that question little. is why are we using blue and red lights? Okay, so uh, just, just switch time that time. on. So that you can see the color. It's uh, 453. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we use blue and red because um, in the spectrometer, if you look at the spec, uh, the absorbance of blue and green algae, um, the peaks will be at the blue and the red the wavelengths, right? Mm -hmm. okay. So we tried to look into it, and then what we saw was that this, there are a, a large number of cells with the blue, hence the cell division is very high. And then for red, the size or the volume of the oil and the, the volume of the algae was greater. Okay. That's why we're using blue and red. Okay. So. Okay. So, I was go, go, go. <laughs> so uh, last year we tried to use um, fluorescent um, uh, what do you call this? Fluorescent bulbs. Okay. Okay. But the problem was there was a UV part okay. of the light and some of the algae Dying. Some of the cells are dying because of the UV light. UV light, okay. Yeah, so that's why we selected um, a very narrow wavelength, wavelength for, the, for this new setup. Okay, so this one, so the red one will be increasing the size? Yes. And the blue one will be increasing the volume? No, the, the, the number of the number, algae. Number of algae. Uh, there are volume, higher volume. Yeah, the okay. First you use this.